What determines penis size? Penises vary in shape and size, but have you ever wondered what factors determine the size of yours? At some point in their lives, most men have concerns about the size of their penis. You are not alone. Questions like, how big will my penis get, is my penis too small, and how can I make my penis longer, are common for everyone with a penis to ask at some point in their lives. It's completely normal to have these questions. Many of these questions stem from false messages you've likely heard from society or the media, particularly from pornography. What determines penis size? There are many theories about what determines the size of a penis, but the truth is that it's not related to your height, foot size, race, or hand size. Your penis size is largely determined by genetics, meaning it is influenced by the genes inherited from your parents. What is the size of an average penis? An erect penis is typically between 4 and 6 inches long, while a flaccid penis usually measures between 2 and 4 inches. The circumference, girth, of an erect penis is generally between 4 and 5.5 inches. What is the right way to measure a penis? Here are the basics of proper measuring. To measure your penis correctly, first make sure it is fully erect. Try to straighten your penis as much as possible keeping it parallel to the floor. Starting from your pubic bone place a measuring tape or ruler along the top of your penis. The circumference, girth, of an erect penis is generally between 4 and 5.5 inches. Measure to the tip of the penis. This is your erect length. Next, wrap a measuring tape around the thickest part of your erect penis, ensuring it's not too tight. This will give you the measurement of its girth, circumference. Now you know exactly how big you are. Can I make my penis bigger? Everyday Love Matters receives spam messages promoting magic products like pills, creams, and devices that claim to enlarge penises. Additionally, some promises offer to make your penis as long as you desire. In reality, none of these remedies are effective, they often only benefit the company selling the product. Even the most medically approved methods don't make significant differences. Is it true that big feet or nose or hands equal big penises? Big feet or nose or hands equal big penises, not true. Scientists have not discovered any evidence linking penis size to the size of any other body part. When we delve into the most common questions about penises, such as whether size is genetic, it falls somewhere between inquiries about whether size truly matters and whether girth outweighs length. For the record, no, and that's a matter of personal preference. Interestingly, or perhaps unsurprisingly, research on penis size has been extensive. Scientists have delved into various aspects, including investigating potential correlations between foot size and penis size. According to current evidence, genes do appear to influence the development of one's genitalia. In a somewhat surprising revelation, it appears that most of the genetic material influencing penis size comes from the mother's side. While men's penis size is primarily influenced by genetics, other factors also contribute. Hormones, lifestyle choices, and environmental factors can impact penis size. Certain lifestyle changes, like weight loss around the base of the penis, can create the illusion of increased length. Trimming pubic hair can also contribute to improving the appearance of your penis. While these adjustments don't alter the actual length of the penis, they can boost your confidence. 
The size of the penis is determined by a blend of genes, particularly the sex chromosomes inherited from parents. These chromosomes determine one's biological sex and secondary sexual traits that emerge during puberty, like facial hair in males and broader hips in females. Additionally, individual genes unique to each person, rather than those inherited from parents, can also impact penis size. Genetic mutations may also play a role in determining the length and appearance of the penis. Furthermore, several other factors can influence penis size, including hormones, nutrition, and exposure to toxins during prenatal development. Size Myths There are numerous myths surrounding penis size, including the belief that larger feet indicate a larger penis. However, there is no correlation between a man's shoe size and the size of his penis. Additionally, other body parts or features do not provide clues about penis size, such as hands, facial hair, etc. Masturbation does not hinder or promote penis growth, nor does the frequency of masturbation matter. Research indicates that penis size is not a significant factor for sexual satisfaction or desirability for either partner. While studies suggest there may be slight variations in penis size based on ethnicity, the differences between ethnic groups are not substantial. One of the most pervasive and harmful myths is the association between a man's masculinity and his penis size. Having a larger penis does not inherently make someone more masculine, nor does having a smaller penis make someone less so. It's normal to have some concerns about penis size, but if these concerns are affecting your ability to pursue sexual relationships or impacting your self-esteem, it's important to seek support. Consulting with a medical professional, sex therapist, or urologist can help you address and work through these feelings. If you enjoyed watching this video don't forget to like subscribe and turn on the notification bell, so you don't miss any new videos. Let us know your thoughts about this video in the comments section down below and feel free to stay and enjoy it until the end, also make sure to check out our next highlighted video and we will see you next time. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe.